<laughs> Welcome to Print Elf. This is another episode where we try to help you design or set up your files for print. Today I'm going to talk about business cards. So if you want to design your own business cards, that's a great idea. You can save yourself a little bit of money. You do it very personalized, you can do a great job, but you're going to have a little bit of a hard time in the beginning until you know a few things that you really need to know. One is bleed. Bleed is the area that goes beyond your business card. So for example, if you have this business card, you see the red area is designed beyond, beyond the cutting line. You need to do it, otherwise you might get some white within your business card. The other area that you have is called the safe area. Well, we have those files, you can download them, and uh, they're already defined with those areas, but you need to know about it because your text should be inside that area, otherwise it might be cut off or being right at the edge, which doesn't look very good. Uh, same here in the back, you see this circle here. This circle was actually designed beyond so that it's cut off and it looks proper. The other thing that you need to know is file size. You can save your file as JPEG files or TIFF files, but they need to be the right size. So the, the horizontal and the vertical pixel count needs to be proper. I'm going to show you this in a little bit uh, right on the, on the computer. Um, the other thing that you know is about CMYK. CMYK is a color space that we use for professional presses. So to give you an idea, if, if for example you see a beautiful red on your monitor, it might be nice to you, but it can be printed because it's out of the color space. It might actually look brown. So just make sure you have that correct. If you're not sure about it, you can send us the file. We convert it to CMYK for you and we send your print so you get an idea what it will look like. Okay, this is, that's really it. But I think mostly you gotta have fun to design your business cards. You know, they take your time, maybe put a photo of yourself in there, touch it up a little bit, um, or maybe you have an, a, a, a nice image you took, use that. You can play with, with text, you can play with proportions, and you are in charge. Make sure you get something really beautiful because as you know, there's only one chance to make a good impression. And I'm sure you know how to do that. Okay, so without further ado, let me get to the computer and explain some of the file intricacies to you. Let me show you the easiest way to get started with your design. Go to printelf.com, print services, business cards, scroll down a bit to download JPEG template. And once you have it in your browser, right click the image, save picture as, and save it at your favorite place on your computer. I already have it saved here, so I don't, I'm not gonna do it again. Then you can close your browser open your favorite drawing program. In this case, I use Photoshop and open the file we just downloaded. Open it a bit bigger. As you can see, we have the file already set up with the cutting line on the outside and the safe area on the inside. You also get guides here which you can turn on and off in Photoshop by hitting Control H. Now let's say I'd like to design a large circle here like you saw in the business card before. Dropping a bit of, oh, let's add a layer. Dropping some red in here. Move it to the side. I'd like to have a cutoff right here. Make sure you go beyond this line and not like this, because there might be a chance you actually get a white line here. So make sure it's like this. Also, this template is already in CMYK mode, but if you're not in CMYK mode, you can go up to image mode and switch, for example, from RGB to CMYK. This is the color space that's needed for press printing. Okay. 
Now, let me show you another example. This is a card that we looked at before. Here you can see the text is inside the safe area. And this little guy, we have to go beyond the cutting area. Now, if you would like to design your own card from scratch, you can define it here, go to new, 1088 by 638 and the resolution at 300 CMYK mode, make sure you're in that. Or if you design RGB, make sure before you save, you go to CMYK mode, you click OK, and you get the same, except in this case, you don't have the cutting and safe area. So I really recommend you download our template, which is much easier. You just get, get ready, you, can, you just download it and you get ready to design. Once you're ready to save, click File, Save As, go to JPEG, and make sure you have IC Profile US Web Coded checked. I'm not going to save now, I'm going to overwrite this here. But that's really all it is. So to reiterate, make sure you work within the safe area, you work beyond the cutting edge if that's what you want, and you are in CMYK mode with 300 DPI. Now, get creative, make a beautiful card, enjoy it. We are going to look at your design and make sure everything is correct. You are in CMYK mode and you go beyond the cutting line. We're going to send you a proof before we actually print. And I wish you very good luck and I wish you a great day or evening, whatever the case may be. Thank you very much for watching this video. Bye bye.